Are you getting the PS5 not enough space error every time you download or install a game, update, or app? In this video, we'll show you the solutions that you can try in order to address the problem. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. Fix number one, check PS5 storage free space. Make sure that your PS5 has actually enough free space that you can use. While the error code C100028 can appear due to a software bug, it can also be a true indicator that you're really running out of storage space in your console. It's not a secret that the PlayStation 5 has poor storage capacity given how huge new games, particularly the AAA games, have become nowadays. At best, you will only be getting a little over 700 gigabytes of storage space capacity right after opening a brand new PS5. That's because about 20% of the total SSD internal storage capacity is dedicated for the OS, first-party apps, and system-related data. Fix number two, reboot the console. After checking how much space is there on your console, the next simple method to fix the error is to refresh the console. If the problem is caused by a minor bug in the system, a quick reboot might help. Here's how to do it. Press the PS button on your controller. Select the power icon at the bottom. Select restart PS5 option. Fix number 3, create more storage space. If nothing has changed after restarting the PS5, you should consider deleting some data to ensure that you have more than enough storage space. Normally, the bulk of stuff that takes up storage space is your games and apps. So, if you have old games that you don't plan to play in the near future, consider deleting them for now. To delete games, follow these steps. Go to your home screen. Go to settings. Select storage. Select console storage. Select games and apps. Find the game that you want to remove. Fix number 4, sign out and sign back into your PSN account. Some players have discovered that logging out of the PSN account and signing back in eliminate the system storage error. If you haven't tried this solution, here are the steps that you need to do. Go to your home screen. Go to settings. Select user and accounts. Select Other. Select Sign Out. Restart the console and sign back into your account. Alternatively, you can delete the account from your console. Here's how. Go to your home screen. Go to Settings. Select User and Accounts. Select Delete Users. Select the account you want to delete and hit Yes. Restart the console and sign back into your account. Fix number 5, use extended storage. Using external storage should be considered as an option if none of the things you've done so far has worked. This is a great option if you have lots of PS4 games that you want to play on your PS5. It's also a practical way if there's not enough free space in the internal SSD. All of your PS5 games can be stored in the PS5's external storage. When you want to put these games back on your PS5, all you have to do is copy the data back from the external storage. This method is easier than re-downloading any game because it takes less time. To use extended storage, go to your home screen, go to settings, select storage, Select USB Extended Storage. Before you extend storage capacity in your PS5, make sure that you prepare the storage device like a USB flash drive ahead of time. Check out the requirements on what you need to do if there's not enough storage space and you plan on using extended storage. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends, this can greatly help